This is a video demo showing how to palpate the bony landmarks on the distal humerus. The demo is on right arm. Let's start from locating the most palpable structure at the elbow. What is the attachment site for the triceps brachii at the elbow? That's right. The olecranon process. It forms the sharp point of elbow. After locating the olecranon process, move directly medial from it. Round bony projection you feel is the medial epicondyle. From there, move superiorly and roll your fingers back and forth to feel for the bony ridge. That is the medial supracondylar ridge. Move back to the olecranon process, and then move laterally from there. Now you are on the lateral epicondyle. Palpate both epicondyles together and compare the sizes of them. The medial epicondyle is bigger than the lateral one. Move superiorly from the lateral epicondyle to feel for the lateral supracondylar ridge. Move back to the olecranon process, and now we are going to find the olecranon fossa on the posterior side of distal humerus. First, you need to make the fossa available for palpation. Flex the elbow to move the olecranon out of the depth of its fossa. And locate the olecranon and move your finger proximally around the top of the olecranon and press firm into the fossa through the triceps tendon. Try to feel for a small crescent-shaped shallow depression. If you have arm extended, the olecranon pushes your finger away from the fossa so it can sit into the fossa. The last structure we will find is the notch for the ulnar nerve. It is also called the groove or sulcus. Have you ever experienced the funny bone sensation when you hit your elbow? Yes. That's the sensation you feel when the ulnar nerve is struck. Let's palpate the notch now. First, palpate the olecranon, and then roll your finger gently toward the medial epicondyle. On the posterior side of the medial epicondyle, you can feel soft, round, and tubular structure. That is the ulnar nerve and it sits on the notch. If you palpate too firm, the person may experience pin prick like shocks down the forearm and into the hand where the ulnar nerve provides the sensation. This is it for the palpation of the bony landmarks on the distal humerus. Thank you for watching.